Hi everyone, it's McKenna on Country Stitcher's YouTube, they got hacked. Just kidding. <laughs> um, we're gonna give you a little fall decor home tour, cause that rhymes, of our house before we start to decorate for Christmas. I got Deb here with me, AKA my mom. And so yeah, we're gonna get started. Um, here's mom. Hi everybody. Okay, <laughs> so we're gonna start here in the foyer. So go ahead, mom. All right. Um, so next to the door here, we have a little Amish made piece of furniture that I put um, a little bit of stitching on and, you know, some um, fall sprigs and a little uh, painted duck, I guess, <laughs> that I got for a couple bucks at a yard sale, which I thought was really cute. You did this too, right? Mm -hmm. Yep. Cute. Thanks. Okay, on to the bathroom. Yes. Here's some stitching I spy. Yeah. Wanted to tell the people about this piece, or? <laughs> um, let's see. So that is an Autumn Bell Pool by Stony Creek. And um, if you need, if you would like to get that pattern, I would just suggest going to Stony Creek's website. That's been made for a long time, hasn't mm -hmm. it? Yes, it has. A few years. Yeah. Okay, here we are in our bathroom, yeah. off the foyer. Mm -hmm. So another... Um, this, this bathroom I like to accent in black, so I have a little chest there that's painted black um, with some things on top, some fall, um, I don't know, greenery and some little pieces around, little, this is not a real scale, obviously, just a fake clock, some wheat, um, my uh, sconces over here are filled with some fall flowers on either side of the window, and on the black shelf, I like to decorate that for all the seasons. Um, below it, over here on the left, hangs the um, red chair sampler that I finished a little while ago, and that's on the black uh, little cutting board. Got some more stuff back here. Yep, little shelf behind the toilet. This is one of my favorite things right here. See this little book? It says my daily guide. This is actually Look, that was your pop-up. Mm -hmm. This was his from 1949. <laughs> Isn't that cool? And it gives him like a little um, prayer and a little verse for each day. Isn't that cute? So cute. Yeah. That's back there. Okay. She'll pull it up for you. And then in the foyer, um, for the bench, I just put some fall colored pillows, a little throw. Um, that shelf that Matt made, I just like to stick just a tiny bit of things up there, a little sign and, and a pumpkin and just a few little things that kind of remind you of fall. Not too much. These over here, though, are very easy to make. Uh, nice DIY projects. It's just a barn board. Uh, you can get the jars, mason jars, and um, just a little clamp here that you can attach it to. And then... We change out what's in it for the season. So this, for fall, this is just the tops of um, corn stalks and then a little bit of wheat put in. So that's it, just go outside and pick, you know, whatever you wanna pick for winter. We'll put in some um, evergreens and uh, for the summer, sometimes it's uh, eucalyptus or fern or, um, you know, just whatever you can find for the season. Nice, cheap kind of decor thing. Over here. And this was a family uh, piece of furniture, so that was um, a pie safe that was Nana's grandmother's um, pie safe. And I just, again, kept it kind of simple on top with some fall things and um, a candle next to it. Okay. And then my um, flower urn that's on the floor here, I like to change that for the seasons. I usually always keep my horse there, and then I just stuck a little pumpkin there that says welcome, and that's always in our foyer. Oh, I had to crawl down to the floor <laughs> for that one. And this is the piece behind uh, the sofa that uh, Matt made. So we have some lights underneath of this shelf here, and these are just battery operated that they stick up underneath. So you can kind of press them, and they have an 
a high, a low, and an off. And they're really nice because you don't have to worry about plugs or cords. And they last quite a long time. So it's kind of cool how they illuminate your area without having to worry about plugs or cords. It's over there too. Mm -hmm. And up here is a old grape uh, box, which we got in New York State. And I keep it here all the time and I like to change out uh, this arrangement for the seasons. Now there's real and there's artificial all together in here. So the real stays there all the time and then I just change it out for the seasons. All of the fall things will come out and then I'll put in some evergreens, some holly, you know, different things like that for the winter. Then I'll pull all of that out and I'll put in different for the spring and the summer. So it's, it's really cool when you can kind of incorporate the um, artificial and the real. I love to have real plants everywhere in the house. And it's good for the air. It is. It does. It cleans your air, honey. <laughs> you kind of just looked at me funny. <laughs> it's good for the air. <laughs> it is. <laughs> Start over here now. Here is my uh, oh, with over here. fall on it. Um, Sorry, um, guys. I'm no professional uh, videographer. <laughs> You're doing great. Close captioning. <laughs> so that is Hello Fall um, on just a fall magnolia wreath. Okay, and here. Yeah, and then next to the TV cabinet, I, we found this um, little cute wagon for just a couple dollars at a really cool um, little antique store. And so I can decorate that for every season. I think it's adorable. And it has some homemade pumpkins, um, like my niece knit this one for me, and, and just some, you know, toilet paper wrapped in some chenille, a little sprig of fall things in there. Um, just, you know, stick in whatever, you, whatever you'd like with some lighted twigs behind it in an urn and then um, a battery-operated candle to the side. Okay, where else would you want to go over here? And in this corner, I always leave my fig tree there with some lights on it. I have some more pumpkins here in the uh, apple basket. Um, this is a little chenille pumpkin over here. I thought that was a pear. Oh, God, it is a pear. Sorry. <laughs> oh, I thought my... <laughs> You're right. <laughs> I was like, that um, is a pear. <laughs> that is a funky looking pumpkin. <laughs> Look, that's me. That's me. <laughs> yep. And then in the basket, I stuck a lantern with a um, candle and some other fall things and um, these are the battery operated twigs in this wooden piece there and that is on my floor scale oh I feel like I'm so shaky I'm so sorry <laughs> mantle yep there's our mantle um, and then I have my Olga stocking hanging up and the witch's boot because I, I just I know that's more Halloween, but I kept it up anyway because it's too darn cute. Get a close up of the mantle for them, sorry. Mm -hmm. Just stepped okay. in your sock. It's all right. Okay. And this cute little lantern here, I have a large one out on the front porch, and I see that the uh, battery operated candle is dead inside of there, but that's a really cool one to light up. And then here on this chair, we just have um, another pillow with some stitching on it. Do you want to show the couch? Uh, yeah, sure, go ahead. Here's the couch. <laughs> <laughs> so I just put my fall pillows on the couch and a fall throw. And here's a pumpkin pillow. Mm-hmm. The and then best for seat the, in the house. <laughs> for the ottoman, I stuck a... Cer um, well, not ceramic, um, cement pumpkin in here in the lantern and, um, you know, just kind of kept that simple and clean. There's Joanna. <laughs> Everyone's fave. <laughs> okay. I'm coming on this side. Do you want to do the top of the TV? Yeah, sure. Okay, you want to do that real quick? Yeah. Um, so on top of the TV, I... I left my fern up there. That was just doing so beautifully from the spring and the summer. <laughs> yeah, it's growing like crazy. And um, put some pumpkins and some twigs of like the orange berries up there. I usually keep my pottery up there. I have a lantern off to the right, which again, I need to work on getting my batteries changed for my candles. 
I can see that that one's not on either. There's like no space behind our TV stand, so to clean up all the fur and stuff that like drops off every once in a while, Connor had to climb over <laughs> the staircase. Way. He had to climb over the staircase. I'll show you. And <laughs> and go back down in between there. <laughs> it was funny. Okay. Where should we go next? Anything um, over here? Yeah, so there's, there's another stitching um, pillow on that chair um, with my monogram in the middle. And then this arrangement, I always have something in there in the corner. I just change it out for the season, so that's the fall arrangement. I'll get ready to put in all of the evergreens for the winter. I'm so sorry, I'm so shaky. <laughs> it's awful. Okay, and some more pumpkins, another scale. Um, on the um, fireplace over here, we just have some pictures and a plant. I have my blessed pillow on the chair. Just kind of kept it really simple for the fall. Um, oh, sorry. It's okay. There's another scale. We have a I theme know. in our house. I, I love scales. Oh, there's some stitching. Yep, there's some stitching. <laughs> What's that called? Do you know? Probably not. Oh, sorry, not offhand, I don't I'll have to look it up. There's your box. Mm -hmm. That's the Stitching Treasures box by Jeanette Douglas. Sorry for my finger. <laughs> my finger got away. Um, okay. And into the kitchen. Oh, show them our cool canvas. Oh, I was gonna say, we just got this. We just got our canvas print back from our family picture. So I have to hang that up, that's why I got it sitting down there. <laughs> Uh, so on the buffet, um, I, there's another scale hidden back here. I always keep uh, these pheasants on this scale, and then I'll change out all of the different things. So I have the ceramic pumpkin and, you know, the orange green or the orange twig stuff. I don't know what you call it. <laughs> I have some weed in here, some other pumpkins, this cute little succulent that is inside of the old teapot. Okay. Um, on our table, I took out my three-tiered tray because McKenna was complaining that we couldn't see each other when we ate dinner. So <laughs> I decided to go simple. This is a wreath made out of just the tops of the corn stalks and um, a wheat bundle in the middle. These two candle holders have battery-operated candles in them. Uh, and then two of the uh, cement pumpkins with a table runner that I found at Home Goods. And this, this table is really special because this was made by Matt and Logan and it was made from floorboards from an old farmhouse. And they had to sand and finish this for a long time because it was painted with so many layers of paint. But it's really special, I love it a lot. Very cute. Yes. Oh, here's some stitching. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think that is Cricut Collection and that is called Autumn. Shocker. <laughs> um, up here we have some of the chicken pictures, my um, rug cooking that I did, and a little candy box. Um, this corner piece was, it's pretty special. That was my mom's um, piece of furniture and I love it a lot. I, I do have white lights in through here, but again, everything's burning out at right the, the exact moment that we need it to, I guess, because we're gonna be changing over the seasons. So we'll replace all of that. Okay. Okay. We shall go here. Okay, and in the kitchen, this is our hutch. Um, this is uh, an amber um, butter churn. I, I got that right before COVID happened. We only had two of our mud sales this year instead of the whole season, which was a shame. But I love, I love that. And I just, again, put a few things here for the fall. Cover over it. How old is that lamp? I feel like oh, I've had my. that lamp our whole life. Oh gosh, honey, I bet you Dad and I got that not long after we were married. Well, that's old then. Oh. <laughs> Just kidding. It's ancient. 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 I'm showing up here too. Okay. And up here. Yeah, we have a shelf up there that has a bunch of 
fun things on it. This is our laundry room, just in case you're wondering what that door goes to. <laughs> okay. And then over here I have my um, Farm Fresh. I always keep that up, so I just stuck a little bit of the, um, the wheat in there and the wheat around the egg basket, a little turkey uh, candy mold here. And then over here, just, you know, a little turkey harvest sign and some more wheat. Got a little coffee area. Most important thing? Mm-hmm, yes. And I always keep a, um, I usually keep this here all year, but I'll change it. I'll keep the white lights, but I'll change it out in, for the seasons. Um, this is really cute. I just found this little doodad for 25 cents at a um, flea market, I think. And I think that's really cute. Just haven't found something to put in it yet. There's some eggplant from the garden. From ours? Yeah. Mm. Yeah. And over here on my scale, another scale. Oh, look, scale right there. Another scale. Told you it's a theme. <laughs> another one, too. Oh, yes. Three scales in this yep. two square feet of space. So I just put another candy mold, a couple little pumpkins. I have a plant. That battery operated candle is not on right now. <laughs> That's the theme, we have a theme of the video. Scales and burnout electric. <laughs> um, and then for this, I usually keep these little wispy greens for the spring and the summer. And then for the fall, I just stick some of the wheat inside of there. Uh, on this scale, I have some of the... Um, Succulents? Uh, yeah, the, they're not real. On here, This one is real. These are not real. Uh, and then just my little cow um, creamer. And then some little pumpkins. Cool. So... Anything and else? That little cutting board there. I'm sure you got that with the. I did. On it. Okay. Okay. So again, I don't think I went overboard and did a lot for fall, but it looks. I think it looks really nice. It looks so you? nice. Wow, my face is bright. <laughs> oh my gosh, we are bright. Wow. It Look at that. There. <laughs> so Liz and I were together, and we just did a video. She just went home for the evening, and McKenna and I thought, well, before we decorate for Christmas. We're going to just show you some fall things real quick. Just see my bedroom. It's already Christmas. She is. She's already decorated for Christmas. Yeah. Halfway. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Good job. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Well, thanks for hanging out with us, and we will see you soon. Bye. I, I did that. Sorry. Bye. <laughs>